Shut up. Shut up. Shut up, shut up. Just shut up, please. I... I need... I need quiet, please. I need to be able to hear myself think. I just need... I just need... You don't get it, do you? You don't... I guess it's whatever. What was I expecting, right? For somebody to finally understand how I feel? For somebody to finally get what I've been going through? Who was I kidding? Just stop. 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 Do you know what it's like? Do you know what it's like to want something? I don't just mean to want it in the sense of having to own it. No, I mean... I mean, wanting something, needing something, striving for something, for something to be so important to you that you need it, that you're willing to do anything for it, willing to sacrifice everything for it, willing to put in the work, willing to put in the effort, willing to try until your skin burns, until your flesh falls off your bones, until you lose yourself, until you don't even know what is the hell that this you're doing anymore. Do you know what it's like? To want something so much that you're willing to die to achieve it. And I don't mean this shitty, old, dumb, fucking stupid way that people threw around this, 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 this concept of I'm willing to die for something. No, I mean truly, truly willing to lose everything. To wake up in the morning and know that the only way that you're going to look at yourself in the mirror and feel like you deserve to be alive today is if you are able to achieve, if you are able to somehow manage, somehow manage I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm so goddamn tired. I'm so goddamn tired. But I need this. This is all that I know. This is all that I have. This is all that I... This is all that I... I've been pushing myself so hard lately. Waking up doesn't even feel like waking up. I've been so scared of going to bed at night. So scared of closing my eyes. So scared of opening them back up. So 
sorry. That wasn't very... Wasn't very cool of me. I snapped out of nowhere. I... I'm fine. This path is what I chose for myself. This journey is what I wanted to do. Whatever burdens, whatever suffering, whatever... Whatever feelings of not being good enough. That's on me. Whether it's the first time, the last time, the 100th time. Whether I can't sleep, whether it's a nightmare, whether... Whether it's heaven itself falling out of the sky. This is my dream to accomplish. This is my cross to bear. Whether I can't walk, whether I need to crawl, whether I need to dig my nails into the floor and drag my body across, I will do it. You know, when I was younger, I was the overachiever. Everything came easy to me. I'd get things done. I'd be the person getting A's, winning races, being a good son, being a good student, being a good person. I was so perfect. Everything just came so easy. But you know what I lacked? I lacked passion. I lacked resolve. I lacked the obsession to want something, to need something. I spent a very, very long time chasing that. And when I finally, finally achieved that goal, when I finally found something that I felt that I could make my own, that I felt like I needed. All of that overachievement just went down the drain. I wasn't good at what I wanted. I wasn't great at what I enjoyed. I didn't succeed. Do you know what it's like? To live with so much regret thinking that maybe, maybe if I had done anything else other than this, it would have been better. But then feeling like if I wasn't doing this, that I couldn't live with myself. Do you know what it's like to want to be the best at what you do, and every day you wake up being mediocre? And then you need to pat yourself on the back and tell yourself, shut up. You want the best. You want the top spot, so go out there and take it. And every day, you feel... Mark my words. I have... destroyed myself. I've broken myself mentally. I've broken myself physically. I've broken myself beyond repair. I've worked myself until my hands are blistered. I've worked myself until my brain can't stop thinking. I've gotten panic attacks. I've gotten... I need this. I need this. And I need you 
to understand just how much I need this. Because I'm falling apart. And I'm barely holding on. And I need you to hold me together. I need you. To tell me things are going to be okay. And when things get bad. And when I lose myself. I need you to be there to remind me. Who I am. Because I cannot stop. I cannot let go of this. I won't let go of this. So I need you to not let go of me. Not now. Not ever. Forever always. <laughs>